The Bowery Bar in Dorchester is known for their lobster mac and cheese made with oversized shells, toasted breadcrumbs, and plenty of sweet meat. We do three to four ounces of fresh Maine lobster mixed in with our mac and cheese. You get almost as much lobster as you do macaroni, which makes it a really awesome dish to eat for dinner. At the Rail Penny Tavern in Epping, New Hampshire, the macaroni and cheese is a popular choice with the whole family. We have our mom's mac and cheese, which really celebrates mom and her good old home cooking. We have our dad's mac and cheese, which is our bacon and scallion added to the mom's. We have a sister's mac and cheese with pesto, and we also have a brother's mac and cheese with good old Maine lobster. Cedar Street Grill in Sturbridge offers a wide variety of mac and cheeses, including the Vermont style, made with sharp cheddar, roasted tomatoes, spinach, and applewood smoked bacon. The bacon gives it a nice salty, crunchy component, and then the spinach it makes people feel a little bit better about eating mac and cheese. One of the trendiest restaurant dishes right now is Cacio Pepe, the Italian version of mac and cheese made with just pasta, pecorino, or parmesan, and fresh cracked black pepper. For more food and fun, watch Phantom Gourmet Saturday and Sunday at 10 and 11 on TV 38.